Alrighty guys, so I've put in the full ring of the first layer. It's looking pretty good. Um, mm -hmm. Of course, we gotta fill in the walls with stuff. That's gonna be tough. Unfortunately, I'm not a builder and I have no idea of what that stuff is gonna be. So, um, yeah. All right guys, so I've done some building and I've got it looking pretty good here. So my idea here was to kind of replicate this style over here and combine it with an industrial look a little bit. So I took stone and stone bricks and bricks and combined everything together. The one thing I'm not sure about is the brick stairs. I wanna know what you guys think of the brick stairs here. And this is the other thing I did was this kind of entrance to the storage area part two. So this is more, you know, regular items and kind of just out and about. And we're gonna go through here eventually and have everything sorted out to things that we want. So each one of these is one item. So, you know, we can have stuff that we actually need sorted out. Okay, but one thing that sets this side apart from this side is the fact that we have that terraforming going on right now. I think it's finally time to at least get a good start on terraforming the cliff sides of all of these. What better way to get that done than a time lapse? So my channel for the past two years hasn't actually changed that much and I've started to notice that not changing things doesn't result in good things. So I'm going to start experimenting again with how videos are made what they look like. Um, I'm just going to start stretching the boundaries with what I'm doing on content. And if you guys have any ideas whatsoever, like even if it's the wonkiest video idea, let me know, please. I really want to know it because chances are I'm actually going to pursue it at least. So give me those ideas. Check it out, guys. Boom. We have stuff going on. Oh, that actually looks way better. It needs some touch-ups, obviously, but just to get that done is huge. So now when you look anywhere in the base, you know, it actually feels a bit better. Obviously, we got to do a bit more on the top layer, but like I said, I think this is a great start to a base. The next thing that we got to do today to at least get a bit more of a start on a base is to finish this little thing here. That's what I want to do. But before we do that, some crazy things have happened at spawn, like, and I mean crazy. So we gotta check out what's going on at spawn. Here I am, and I'm seeing you might want to record when at spawn. So, all right, here we are. We're at spawn. <laughs> oh man, the pranks have begun. There used to be a rocket ship right up there, and now it's being sliced in half with some green ooze. Uh oh. There's green ooze over there. What's going on over here? Oh no, toxic fuel spill. Oh no. And so this up here, what is going on? <laughs> this is in quarantine because of caution, dangerous fuel spill, DSMC under investigation for use of fossil fuel and toxic fuel. And it's an electric plant. I knew this was a diesel truck, guys. I knew that. Fuel spill or no fuel spill, guys, there is going to be some scandals happening on the server. I mean, what else is there gonna be if not any of that? Holy crap. But my base, guys, needs some more work, okay? So these edges here, they don't look complete like this does. This looks really good. This looks mm, beautiful. But not over here. We didn't do it all around. So we might, ha might have to do that, but more importantly, we need to figure out what we want to put where on this top layer so we can actually plan for things to be attached like it is here. This is all attached in. We're going to, of course, put greenery in. This is, yeah, this is just the base, the base of everything. Okay, I am not a builder, guys. Like, <laughs> I've, I, I feel like I've said that way too much on my channel. But I'm really not. I, I've tried so many times to enjoy and be good at building. But I'm on this server um, 
with all these afterlife members who are just amazing builders. And then there's me who just builds things like this. <laughs> what? It, it, sometimes I question, I question myself being here because just, oh man, oh goodness. Anyways, all I can do is try. So let's try out some new blocks. Like an inexperienced mechanic, I am not bringing the traditional tools to the job. Essentially, what I'm gonna try here is in this these gaps, we're gonna put pink terracotta. Uh-huh. Now pink is a cool color because I'm thinking about using pink at the next layer. Uh-huh, I know, crazy, right? I have some cool plans. So I wanted to try pink here just as kind of like something to link it. And you know what? That doesn't look too bad. That doesn't look too bad at all. Orange, flowers, pink. I like that. I like that a lot. You know, come to think of it, I'm probably not the great, the greatest at redstone either. Like, I'm just not a very good player now that I think about it. <laughs> How does that feel? That doesn't feel too bad, actually. I'm, I'm going to get rid of this. I'm going to trim that up. I like that a bit more like that. And this side feels pretty natural, really. I mean, that's... Maybe we have some water coming down here, actually. Yes. Two. All right, let's see how that looks. Honestly, I can't complain. It's going to go all the way down there, but that's okay. I kind of like it. It, it really kind of just brings your eyes into like, oh, wow, that's kind of cool. What does it look like from, say, the other side? Like, does it, is it too distracting? You know, it is pretty distracting. Like, it's quite, uh, it's quite, you, you notice it a lot. Um, now, say I couldn't see that, I'd just see this bit. It still would be somewhat distracting. Like, I'm kind of blocking it on my, like, from my personal view. I, I'm not really, I don't think it'll be a problem. I like it. I like it a lot, actually. Okay, one thing that goes well with stone is acacia logs, but not the stripped variant. So this gray is has a little tint to it that just brings things out. So what I wanna do is along the edges here, I want to acacia log this up, uh-huh. That's my new thing, acacia logging things. Okay, so it does change the dynamic, I feel like, but I think the bricks are still too boring I think what needs to happen is variation. Doesn't that feel better? That feels better to me. Iteration number two, I like this one a little bit better, but I've done this variant right here with the stone bricks on the side. So mm -hmm. let me know between the first one you saw, that one you saw, or this one you saw, which one is your favorite? I, I'm unsure. Obviously up here we would do something else because we're gonna kind of join it in to the the cliff side that's going to come over here this is going to be enclosed is my hope uh, believe it or not i'm planning on enclosing it and hanging lights from the top oh yes so that's how it's going to go and then we're going to have a wall here so it's going to be a little interesting to see how it comes together but i was contacted by the great ashes den and he told me to meet him right outside of my base so i did ah Puff, so I just came back from spawn yes. and, and hanging out with GP and all this Wait, can we read, can we read it? Can we, can we start? I can't, can oh no! Whoa, GP! Huh? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> is there stuff down here? <laughs> oh my god. Oh yeah, it's down here. <laughs> oh, <no>. uh, <laughs> I'm choking on air. Oh, I don't have enough inventory space. Uh, I do, it's fine. So, Puff, I, I've just been having a crazy time. All this stuff at spawn is getting me stressed out, but you know what? Look at this. Look at looks this. Great. Dude, this looks awesome. Oh, <laughs> hi, GP. Hi, GP. Hey. <laughs> uh, how's the field coming? Uh, field's coming pretty good. Yeah, you know, it's, uh -huh, uh, uh -huh, uh -huh. it's starting to work on its, yeah, it's going good uh -huh. thanks ash and uh here's nice. your here's your stuff we, we totally weren't just like chatting five minutes ago no no mm -hmm. definitely not no 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 <laughs> oh i don't have my light you know what i've done that before too G uh, gp i i've done that too gp who <laughs> oh. <laughs> 
Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> this is a great recording. I just, oh my I, Lord. I love it. I, I actually meant to fly too, and I was like, oh yeah, I'm just gonna pull up the last moment, and then I pulled up and I splat. Oh man. Oh. <laughs> Puff, I do need to ask you a question. Oh yeah. Where do you want? Where do you want the path to like go into your base? Because oh, want... come over here, over here. So you see how my base has this um trident thing, this trident room. Oh yeah, I see this. Uh -huh. So I want the pathway to come through this wall here. Okay, so I can just break down this wall and have it kind of like come inside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And oh, you guys both have tridents, lucky. I Wait, bought a trident from this shop, but I'd never enchanted it with anything cool. So despite having a lot of things happen in this episode, guys, it's over. I hope you've enjoyed it. I sure have. And just a quick mention, I am going to try to be uploading more and more consistently starting from now on. Uh, I've finally figured out my schedule and stuff, so keep your eyes off for that. And also, on a side note, I think you guys are going to start enjoying Afterlife a little bit more. We're going to start doing some more interesting things. You know what's really weird is the side that you drive on the road. Because in America, it's on the right side. But in other places, it's on the left side. And it's just all crazy. I don't get it. What's go? Who? Why did people change it? Just pick one.